bone marrow aspiration and biopsy are essential procedures for diagnosing hematologic disorders, metastatic cancers, and marrow-related conditions. Image guidance for bone marrow biopsy reduces complications and improves the success rate of bone marrow aspiration and biopsy. Fluoroscopy provides real-time visualization, making it ideal for faster procedures, while CT guidance offers higher precision, especially for deep or complex biopsy sites. This animation demonstrates the step-by-step -step process of performing a bone marrow biopsy using a bone biopsy needle under fluoroscopy and CT guidance. The most common site for bone marrow biopsy is the posterior iliac crest. The patient is positioned on the procedure table in the prone position. The skin is sterilized and a sterile drape is applied to maintain a sterile field. If using fluoroscopy for guidance, the proper trajectory for needle advancement is picked up. Then, local anesthesia, such as lidocaine, is injected to numb the skin. Followed by numb the subcutaneous tissues and periosteum using a Chiba needle, ensuring patient comfort during the procedure. After creating a skin nick, a bone biopsy needle is advanced through the skin and soft tissues under real-time fluoroscopic guidance toward the posterior iliac crest. As the needle reaches the bone cortex, it is advanced with gentle rotational movements until it enters the narrow cavity. The live fluoroscopy images help confirm the correct positioning before aspiration. The stylet is removed, and a large heparinized syringe is attached to the needle hub. Negative pressure is applied to aspirate liquid bone marrow, which is then collected into specialized tubes. In some cases, pathology slides are prepared at the bedside for immediate assessment. Once the aspiration is complete, the outer biopsy needle is advanced further to obtain a core sample of solid marrow, which is then carefully removed and placed in a specimen container for pathology analysis. CT guidance provides superior precision for deep or complex bone marrow biopsy sites. A preliminary CT scan is performed to identify the exact biopsy location and determine the safest needle trajectory. The skin and periosteum are anesthetized with local anesthesia. Based on the planned trajectory, the biopsy needle is advanced through the skin toward the bone under intermittent CT guidance. Serial scans are used to confirm the position of the needle tip as it enters the cortical bone. Similar to the fluoroscopic technique, bone marrow aspiration is performed, followed by obtaining of a core tissue sample. Once the sample is collected, the needle is carefully removed and the biopsy site is compressed to control bleeding. At the end, a stale dressing is applied at the access site. A final CT scan may be taken to check for complications such as hematoma formation.